How to Become Rich in Your 30s Apart from having a steady source of income, being financially buoyant requires intentional efforts to achieve. Though it is permissible to ignore savings and investment in your 20s, it is important to note that the actions taken in the 20s determine how solid the foundation for the 30s is. Even though much is not talked about concerning financial security as a college student or a job seeker, it is quite helpful to grasp on the rudiments for becoming rich by the time you turn 30. In this video, we will be sharing with you how you can be rich in your 30s. If you are new here, consider subscribing so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. 1. Start saving in your 20s The ants are historically referred to as wise. They are organized and resourceful. Knowing how weak they could be in the face of unfavorable weather conditions, the ants strive to put away foods and other items necessary for their survival following the days of adversity. The essence of saving money is to have enough money you can put together to start a business or invest, two ways by which you can make a lot of money. If you are not disciplined enough to save money at your 20s, you cannot be rich at your 30s. 2. Stay away from debts to become rich, you have to close up the mouth of debts. Taking a loan with a high interest rate is a guarantee to run into being in debts if one default is paying back as at when due. This boils down to what one's purpose to use a loan for. Will it be for a financially gainful business or to buy a house? It is not wrong to borrow to get a living residence. Nonetheless, a house could be a liability when there are no other plans to stay buoyant after paying the bank or worse still, when there is no other source of income to get money from to repay the debt incurred. Using your credit card to fund a frivolous lifestyle such as partying every other day can heavily attract debts that are very difficult to clear. As much as life is fun to live, being carefree towards a responsible living does not only make one poor, it also humiliates in place of honor. 3. Have multiple streams of income it is socially acceptable to hold a 9 to 5 job which promises rewarding retirement benefits. That notwithstanding, unless you are consciously working towards being the chief executive officer of the firm, you cannot be rich on a monthly salary or compensations alone. You need to create another source of income. Investing is a passive source of income. Nowadays, the internet has become an endless hub of opportunities for money making even for the most busy persons in the world. Blogging, graphic design, sales marketing, writing, vlogging, advertising, and virtual assistants have proved to be enigma of income-yielding part-time jobs. Many have pursued their spare time hobbies and gotten rich in return. 4. Network with successful people It is known that Bill Gates got the idea to build Microsoft when he read a magazine he took from a friend. Networking meaningfully does more than giving you a job. It also spurs you to be successful in order to stay relevant. To network with people is not done strictly during reunions or high-profile gatherings. It can be done virtually by joining groups that mirror your thoughts, life pursuits, and career advancements. Such places provide immense opportunities and advice that can propel one to better heights. Remember also that when you teach or render words of advice that build another up, you also help yourself to work on becoming better. 5. Fine-tune your desire to invest your money When investment is mentioned, one could immediately start thinking of hundreds of thousands of dollars committed in real estate or in stock trading. Such thoughts are quite false and limited. Lots of money are not needed to make investments. The real estate or stock trading domains are not the only avenues to expect a financial return from with respect to investment. Committing money you can call your spare change into micro-investing apps which have been designed to make investing fun, simple, and easy to do. Investing in low-cost index fund is highly recommended for individuals who have little or no knowledge about the stock market and the competition in it and for those who cannot pay professionals to actively manage their funds. Over time, the seemingly little spare changes will accumulate into huge financial gains. You can invest in your skills and get a rewarding outcome from it. 
spending time to take on new courses in your area of expertise or delving into an entirely different career can bring about a remarkable improvement in the quality of your earnings. 6. Start a business A business is an asset which can be a monumental investment. It is also beneficial to the unemployed of the society. Venturing into starting a business can be very, very intimidating coupled with the daily news that emerge on the ill-fated ones which were promising from the beginning. Money aside, a business requires hard work, diligence and foresight to be established. You must have a passion and good amount of dedication to successfully float a business. Essentially possessing the right knowledge supported by the inputs of professionals in that chosen area make for a profound startup and improvement. To run an ideally successful business, you must hire personnel who are willing to run with your vision. They must be trained on the job. You must learn to trust their capabilities and should ensure you develop a system that rewards excellence and that which checks excesses in employees. 7. Learn to take no from people in good faith There are times when you strongly believe that everyone in his right mind should see ideas the same way you do. You know you have got all it takes to solve difficult problems which others fail to acknowledge. The business proposals and presentations end up being snubbed at by people who you hold in high esteem. You are tempted to assume that the universe has conspired with humans to run you down. Pause for a moment. Sometimes, the vehement no from people could be a savior to you. Rejections from those who you believe in is a tool for self-appraisal and for idea reinvention. It could also mean they are not ready for your revolution. Keep pursuing that idea and do all it takes to back it up with actions. When you take no's to heart, you may end up severing relationship ties that could serve you well in the future. It is a sign of maturity to still smile and joke with a person who does not see eye to eye with you business-wise. It is achievable to be rich in your 30s. You must be able to invest your money, save, stay away from debts, have multiple streams of income, network with successful people, start a business and learn to take rejections with a good heart. As T. Hav Eka said, rich people are committed to being rich, poor people want to be rich. It is not enough to desire to be rich in your 30s, it is required that you become committed with actions to become rich. Thank you for watching our videos. We'd like to give you another interesting video for you to enjoy next. But before then, our team will be very happy if you can like this video and share it with your friends on social media. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Look at your screen now to see two other videos we unpicked for you to enjoy next. We love you.